Okay, so I'm just testing Bandicam here. Been giving different uh, programs a try. Most of them sucked. This one looked promising. I tried Fraps, didn't really like how the whole 30 second interval thing kind of sucked. <coughs> I tried Game Cam. It was kind of glitchy. I also tried Cam something. I can't remember what it was. Um, anyways, might as well use this for my tour of Brindy's castle, because I think this one's going to work. It looks promising. Hopefully. Hopefully it doesn't give me the same issues as Cam something, because the audio wouldn't work. Ever. Um, and the test I did of this looked pretty promising, so the leg's not too bad. This is the front gate. Oh, this is for my D&D &D campaign, by the way. One of our characters has a bit of a, a keep. Um, and, um, she's a dwarf. So, um, here's Myrtle Soap Factory. This is another member of our party. Brindy's best friend. <clears throat> so here's a little storeroom. A little, um, area to sell your soaps. A little light. Right there. A little light. Okay. Anyways, here's the little guard post. I'm going through this kind of fast, or going to go through this kind of fast, because, um, I've done this about 20 times with different, uh, video recording things. So, I got little levers and gates all over the place for, like, just in case there is a siege. You have to close all the things, smash them, then no one can get in. Ha ha ha. Um, so there's the little guard post. Weapons. Going up in the guard tower here. Ooh, left that open. Um, shooting people hole. <clears throat> so, let's go up here quick. This is the, um, yeah, tower. Go back down here. Whee! Okay. So, that goes along here. Blah, blah, blah. Got this little stairway down. The impassable mountainside over here. I mean, just this impassable. Um, okay, well, that's new. Yeah. Why don't you guys get up here? I'm gonna knock these guys back in the city real quick. No! Well. Okay, whatevs. Whatevs, you guys. Anyways. Here is the, um, smithy. Wall of oven. Thingy, full of lava. Little room back here. <coughs> My throat is really dry. I've been doing a lot of commentary for different videos that will never see the light of day. Um, not sure what I'm gonna do with this part. I was just gonna leave it kind of like a mini mine, but I'm lazy. So, a little nice, uh, music player there. Isn't it neat? Um, so I could test out in-game audio that way. Oh, that seemed to be working before when I did the uh, quick test. Here's the well. Might as well test light. I guess pretty dark down here. Okay. Here's a little farm with the piggies and um, sheep and dog that keeps trying to eat my sheep but can't because it's stupid and cows that are missing that's interesting I don't think you guys ate cows I think you guys just ate sheep that you can never get to because you're stupid um, <clears throat> it's weird they haven't done that for a while um so yeah, yeah, chickens up here. Little escape route. Get the ocean leopard. He really likes his escape route for some reason. Like he just will not leave. That's Bert, the chicken man. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo, down we go. Oh god. I'm pretty sure they don't eat cows. So I'm wondering where my cows went. They were in there forever, forever. Um. 
Front gate. Hi guys. Um, so yeah, we're killing people. Lava. This is the room where you drop shit on people down here. This lever locks them in, so they're trapped. Here's the lava. Plenty of like TNT and buckets and food, and so you can outlast a siege. Though if you lock yourself in that room, you're pretty effed anyways. Here is the little dining area. The red room. <clears throat> a little fire, all this stuff. Kitchen. Or a little serving room, serving area here. Cafeteria. And, um, kitchen. Making the food. Um, let's go around the room here. Uh, library tower is not done yet. But it's a fun climbing wall! Woo! Um, this is the meeting room. The big, yeah, and drippy, drippy cave thing going on there. Um, this is Marcus, the, um, Amu. Marcus, the, um, meeting room golem. Yeah. Eventually this will be the, um, uh, one of the ways into the mines. Not sure where I'm gonna put the entrance, but I'll figure it out. But that's Brundy and Myrtle's throne. Myrtle's Brundy's best friend. This is the living quarters and the public bath, so... Here's the living quarter. They're all pretty much the same. Basic rooms. Oh, he really has to go to the bathroom. Or stand on the sink. Oh, and those are representing mirrors, so... There aren't really any mirrors in games. So I just put little pictures there. This will go down to the public bath here. Like, down like that. And there'll be a nice little natural light thing going on, and water, and there's gonna be private rooms up here, um, like the big fancy ones, for Myrtle and Brindy and our bard, which is me, I love bards, crazy bard that died at ninth level, because he got attacked by a mummy, mummy, mummy lord, um, let's see, and everybody abandoned him. Uh, and these lovely rosebush esque mushrooms keep flying everywhere. Um, so if this cuts off, um, which it might at 10 minutes, I don't think it's the last 10 minutes, um, I will just do a little mini segment. Um, so here's the way to the bathroom for this big area. Yeah, obviously, they don't know how to use bathrooms. Bathroom sinks. There's a difference. Um, this is the way into the tavern. So, put it next to the tavern. Quick way over, in case you have to throw up. Hopefully they'll make it. Put in some different music here. Do, 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 do. Um, try chirp. I don't know what chirp is, but we're gonna try chirp. Ah. Oh. Anyways. This, yeah, tavern. Here's a little bar area. Music player in there. And, um, yeah. That's it for the tavern area. This is the training room down here. <clears throat> Got our training dummies. Can hit them with a sword. I occasionally click the wrong button because I'm in creative mode and end up popping their heads off. But, um, yeah. Mushroom. Uh, lava training floor, sink over there for wiping your face off, and my favorite part is the... Ooh, ooh, a little bit of lag there. Archery! It's great. Whew. So, obviously I'm always a little to the right. Always. Anyways. Thank god this is on peaceful mode, because being a dwarven keep, it's kind of darker and light. And, uh, there'd be so many creepers just hanging around, I'm pretty sure. Um, I think that's it for inside here. Um, anything I'm missing? I don't think so. Yeah, 